Knock knock. Who's there? Radio. Radio who? Ready or not, it's New Year! Hello and welcome to the Spiral Dimension. I'm Dr. Von Hoot and this is the Magic Badger. Say hello, Magic Badger. Hi. Yeah, today, ooh, it's my birthday. Yeah, so I've, I've gone and bought myself something a bit nice. Something a bit nice. I like it very much. I'm very excited. As usual, Badger doesn't have a clue what it is. And we've got this stack of other bits and pieces that I've, but the, the stack is growing. It's growing and it's growing. We need to start getting some through, through, start getting through some of these books. So I thought we'd open these up and see how it goes. Whoosh. Lead. Oh, cool. Yes. Miles Morales, issue 16. I think this is the first cover appearance of Billy Morales, his little baby sister. <laughs> and he's, he's got a little Peter Porker spider ham. That's nice. Is this a variant or is this the original? No, it's, I think it's just the. Uh, it's nice. It's a nice cover. I like that. Cool. I've read all of it. Uh, yeah, just building up the Miles collection there. Great stuff. <laughs> ah, Tomb of Dracula. Amazing. Always oh, lovely. Yes. Issue 23. The Hence variant up there. Seven pence this cost back in the day. Seven pence. You can't buy you can't buy a sweet for seven pence anymore. Oh, I love it. It's a really lovely cover. Um, oh, a few some some spine tickage down there, but nice, nice. I like. Uh, I, I'm not going to knock it. Don't know how much I paid for it because it's probably been there for about two months. Yeah, cool. So that's, uh, I'm, I'm well and truly getting my uh, Tomb of Dracula collection underway now. All right, and the final of the Roars. This one has been there for ages and it has a slit already in it, which uh, is a bit worrying, but let's uh, crack it open. Right, so no boards on these ones. No, we can already, already tell they're older. No boards. Off this then. It's got an advert for the X Men Tiger electronic little handheld on the back, so it's got to be mid, oh, early 90s. Hey! Yeah, Tom Toxic Avenger, issue 10. Lovely. Well, that means that the rest of these, I think, are all Toxic Avenger, and I think it completes my little run of Toxic Avengers because. Whoosh, they um, they only did I think eleven issues and I've got them all now, so that's awesome. Oh, they will certainly need rebag warning. <laughs> what a cover! That's that's proper New Jersey Trumbleville, if ever there was one. Oh, that's so cool. Special stupid fresh rap issue. <laughs> See, word to your mother. No? Okay. Um, what was what's the next cover? Oh, this is cool. Uh, the toxic around it. Whoosh. Issue 8. And this one's in uh, pretty good condition. I know I say it every time the Toxic Avenger thing comes up, but who thought the Toxic Avenger was suitable for children? I suppose this is Toxic Avenger rather than Toxic Crusaders, but still. Oh, lovely cover. Issue 7. 
the S- <laughs> Solvlaki Sewer Syndrome, part one of two. Oh, and that's part two. Okay, cool. One day I'll actually read these. Whoosh. And issue six. Oh, that's a cool cover. It's almost like a homage to the uh, Hulk cover, if you think about it. Oh, I suppose that's not Toxie, that's Frankenstein sort of monster looking. Ooh, interesting. Awesome. Really chuffed that they're uh, finally in the collection. I, they definitely need rebag and boarding because they. The bags are in rough shape, but yeah. Cool. Right, on to my birthday present. I've been a good boy, I think. So, yeah, I thought I'd splash out a little bit. And this is a key that I've wanted for ages. And I'm very excited. Because I got a, a, you know, a good price below FMD. Put that on top of that. There you go. Hug for Slab City there. Check out their eBay auctions because they have stuff like this on there. <sighs> you ready? Whoosh. Oh, I love it. Whoosh. This is the first appearance of the Black Cat. And uh, if you've watched my older videos, I went through a stage of getting quite a lot of Black Cat because I've always, you know, I like, I like Black Cat quite a lot. And yes, Amazing Sp- Spider-Man 194, yeah, first appearance of Black Cat, aka, well, it's the other way around, Felicia Hardy, aka the Black Cat. And uh, yeah, it's wonderful. Yeah, it's in a 6.5 and um, it's, that's pretty much like where my budget is at for this kind of book, I think. So I was pretty pleased. I got it below FMB. I won't go into too much detail, but yeah, it was yeah very good. Oh, and it, it looks nice. It looks nice. Oh, I don't rages. Oh, it looks like there's a bit of a noose and ring. Yeah, there is a bit of a noose and ring. It's okay, it's not, it's not, um, it's not particularly noticeable, so it's all right. Cry about that one. But yeah, important book this, and be even harder to get when inevitably the Black Cat comes to Spider-Man movies, because, you know, she's a big old character. Cool. So yes, happy birthday to me. <laughs> Cool, thanks for your help, Badger. And uh, thanks for watching. Comment down below, tell me what you thought about everything. And uh, please like and subscribe. And we'll catch you next time in the Spiral Dimension. Peace! From the Spiral Dimension.